Hey there YouTube, this is Vargas XX78 with another Tales from the Vargas Vault video. Um, after finishing editing my last pickup video, um, I was filling out my worksheets. As a means to, you know, keep track of everything that I own, I fill out worksheets every time I pick up something. And as I was doing that with the movie collection, I realized that I have just reached 402 movies. Now, physically, I do own only 378, uh, you know, uh, box DVDs. But some of them are double features, some of them are box sets that contain more than one DVD. So, you know, adding that up, I do have 402 movies, which, you know, like most of my other collections, I never thought I would reach that many. So I thought that it was it was time to make a video, and uh, you know a very quick video, hopefully, uh, just showcasing my collection, uh, pointing out some of my favorite ones. So uh, that's what we're gonna look at right now, and hope you like it. Okay, guys. So this is the first part of the DVD collection. Uh, here I have all my uh, video game related or video game promotional DVDs. You know, like the two Metal Gear sagas. Uh, this is the Xeno Saga Limited Edition DVD. Basically has all the cutscenes from the first game on a disc. Uh, here I have this uh, Jack and Daxter Trilogy DVD. It has, you know, all the story from the Jack and Daxter series. Got my uh, Final Fantasy on Blu-ray DVD. And you know, Final Fantasy Spirits within on UMD. Uh, Pokemon Destiny Deoxys, it's a, a cool Pokemon movie. Uh, Street Fighter 2, the animated movie, that one's really, really cool. Got Resident Evil uh, Degeneration, this is a CGI movie that follows the events of Leon and, you know, follows uh, Leon and Claire after the events of Resident Evil 2. Got Extension, Apocalypse, and the first Resident Evil on UMD and DVD. Silent Hill is actually a really, really cool uh, video game adaptation. It's actually done very well, so I enjoyed that one. Uh, got Silent Hill comic book on UMD. Max Payne, Tomb Raider. You know, both, all, both Tomb Raiders and uh, Tomb Raider 1 on UMD. Mortal Kombat. These are motion comics I got free at Comic-Con. There, you know, like, uh, there's like six volumes of, of the comic book, but they have little motion and they have voice acting, so I thought that was cool. Got both Ultimate Avengers movies, the animated Transformer from the 80s, uh, Return to the Back Cave and Ghost World, both uh, the first two Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles live action movies. Not interested in getting the third one, but I am interested in getting that CGI movie that came out. I got Watchmen, League of Extraordinary Gentlemen, both really, really overlooked and awesome, uh, you know, comic book based movies. 300, Sin City, Spawn, Constantine, a really, another good one. Both Hellboys, I'm really, really hoping they make a Hellboy 3 because the Hellboy series is really, really awesome. And we got Before Vendetta, both Punishers. Daredevil, another movie that a lot of my friends hate, but I, I, I enjoyed. Ghost Rider, Two Blades, I'm missing the third one, and the second Fantastic Four with the Silver Surfer, I'm still missing the first one. Down here I got the Deluxe Edition of Spider-Man 2, the Collector's Edition of X-Men 3, an X-2 and X-Men 1.5, which is just the first one with an extra bonus disc DB, uh, in it. Got uh, only two Batman animated, and that's Under the Red Hood and Mask of the Phantasm. Dark Knight, epic movie. Gotham Knight is uh, uh, that collection of animated stories. Batman Begins, Forever, and Batman. Just missing uh, Batman Returns. Here I have the 60s Batman movie with Adam West. The first Superman. This I got from one of my brothers as a Christmas present and it's uh, it has Hell in a Cell and La uh, TLC so this this one has six, six discs on it so I thought that was cool uh, WrestleMania 25 24 at No Way Out Missing 23 
We got 22, 21, 2019, and Volume 1 of the WrestleMania Anthology. And I got uh, specific wrestler-specific DVDs like McMahon, Piper, Hogan, and Rey Mysterio. And we have some UFCs. Uh, South Park the movie and a UMD forum that has like three South Park episodes. The two Star Wars Family Guys. Missing the third one, but I'm not really interested in that one. Family Guy, Volume 1 to 4. Simpsons, Season 5. 4, 3, 2, and the first one. Uh, Halloween, Simpsons. The Complete Pushing Daisies series. Big Bang 1 and 2. First Glee, second season of Dave Chappelle. Uh, first season of MASH, True Blood, Veronica Mars, The Ghost Whisperer, Heroes. Uh, season 2 of Battlestar Galactica, season 1 of 24 and Melrose Place. Also have this free sampler I got at Comic Con. It has, um, it has uh, one episode of Sliders. One of uh, Earth Two and Cleopatra Twenty Five Twenty Five. So yeah, here we got my anime collection. Really random animes, but they're really cool. Animatrix, another um, animated short stories based on the Matrix, like Dragon Balls. Um, Blue Gender. Can't see it, but scans and uh, volume one of Neon Genesis Evangelion. Uh, some more anime. Akira, classic anime. Ninja Scroll, another good one. Uh, the Ghost in the Shell TV series and Ghost in the Shell movie. Full Metal Panic, really, really cool mech anime. Samurai X is by far my favorite anime. Just the story is really, really cool. And we go into my Disney collection with Bambi, Snow White. And we got some more of the princess movies. My Pixar collection. This, uh, this is Wally. Really, really cool. Big fan of, of Pixar. Uh, this is The Rescuers. Nightmare Before Christmas and Corpse Bride. Who Framed Roger Rabbit, the first two Ice Age, the first two Shreks, Madagascar Shark Tale. This is my Christmas uh, DVDs. This is Year Without Santa, and this is Santa Claus is Coming to Town in the Grinch. This is a really, really cool collection. This is my Akira Kurosawa box set. It has three DVDs that contain Redbeard. Seven Samurai and Throne of Blood. Seven Samurai is really, really cool. Uh, all of the movies are set in feudal Japan. And I'm a huge, huge uh, Japanese fan. So, really, really awesome collection. I mean, this is my martial arts section with Crouching Tiger, House of Flying Dragons, Heroes, Kung Fu Hustle, uh, Samurai Avenger, Ninja Assassin. Then we got uh, Karate Kid. All three rush hours, Kill Bill. This is that um, Western box set I showed a few months ago. We got Desperado, Man Who Would Be King, some random war movies. The first Rambo and the last Rambo, as well as the ra last Rocky. I want to get the first one. This is the Die Hard collection. I'm missing Die Hard 4. Uh, Fifth Element, really, really cool sci-fi movie. Really, really love it. Some Disasters. My 007 collection. My Born Identity. Some more action flicks. Inception. Gotta love Inception. Really, really cool. And Terminator 2, some of my favorite action movies. Then we enter sci-fi. This is my Star Wars collection. Got the complete trilogy, the first prequel movies. Uh, this one I got as a Walmart exclusive. It's the story of Star Wars that basically bridges the 
old trilogy with the new trilogy, the original trilogy, that Ewoks movie, my only two Star Treks, this is my monster set movie section, you know, like Gremlins, Jurassic Park, The Horrible, American, Godzilla, Cloverfield, and King Kong. Some sci-fi horror with The Fly, Pitch Black, and Alien vs. Predator. Uh, I don't, I'm still debating if I should put these two in my comic book section or leave it in my sci-fi horror. Because, you know, Aliens and Predator started as sci-fi horror, so that's why it's there, but I don't know. This is my horror section. Halloween, really cool. The first Nightmare Before Am Street. My Friday the 13th collection. The only two sauce I own. Then this is my uh, ghost section because it has the others, creep show, uh, the devil's backbone, the orphanage, the ring, the grudge. Uh, Final Destination 2 and this is and uh, Drag Me to Hell. Drag Me to Hell is another really really good movie. I really enjoyed that one. And I have my werewolf section, my vampire section, and my zombie section here. Uh, the mummy, you know, he's kind of like a zombie. And these are my horror comedies with the Monster Squad, Sean, Zombie Land, and Scary Movie, and Ghostbusters One and Two, which then opens sex way into my uh, comedy section with Bill Murray, Groundhog Day, uh, more comedies, Forty Year Old Virgin, really really cool funny movie, Girl Next Door, another really good comedy and it stars you know Alicia Cuthbert who's mega hot and we got Tropic Thunder The Hangover uh, this is my Adam Sandler collection and my Kevin Smith collection here are then my musicals Uh, these are this is like my feel good section because you know it has inspiring movies and my thriller section with Alfred Hitchcock and Citizens Kane. Uh, this is the deluxe edition of Spider Man One because I quite frankly don't have any space in my comic book section. Uh, these are another uh, bunch of in, you know inspiring movies like Eight Mile, The Pianist. Up in the Air and 500 Days of Summer, Lost in Translation, another really, really good movie. Uh, we got a Big Fish, then I enter my fantasy collection with the Lord of the, Ring, Lord of the Rings trilogy, the only three Harry Potters I own, Never Ending Story, Pond's Labyrinth, another really good, good movie. And finally my documentary section with uh, like this one's uh, Kevin Smith interviewing Stan Lee. This is William Shatner and Leonard Nimoy interviewing each other. Uh, this one's interesting. I got this free at at Comic Con, and it's the IFC Media Lab. It contains all the best shorts from 2006. And I got this free at Comic Con. It's still sealed. I haven't even had a chance to see it. And Last I checked on eBay, there was this guy that was selling a copy, a sealed copy for 150 bucks. So I guess it's kind of rare. But yeah. So that's it, guys. This is my movie collection. A lot of, lot of really awesome movies, and I, I'm still missing a whole bunch of movies. But so far, this is it, and I thought it was worth making a video of it. Well, that's it guys. Um, hope you enjoyed this look at my DVD collection. Until I see you again, this is Vargas XX78. Signing off.